Fall officially arrived on September 22nd, which means the Halloween season isn't too far behind. Here on Lake Orion, the annual zombie walk unofficially rings in the Halloween season. For us, it kind of is, you know, because of course that's one of our mainstays, you know, costumes and makeup and masks and things like that. So, so yeah, for us, um, we get that part of it out of it. It's kind of a kickoff for us and people that haven't been down here see our store, things like that, you know, but they also, they're seeing a the whole downtown too. And, you know, but this thing, this kind of thing is, it's just good for Lake Orion. It's another fun thing for Lake Orion, you know. On the evening of Saturday, September 18th, dozens of participants gathered at the corner of Flint and Broadway Streets for the start of the 8th annual Zombie Walk. Some arrived early at Ed's Broadway gift and costume to have their makeup applied. Just after 8 p.m., the Zombie Walk was underway. <laughs> I'm shot to pieces, Rooster. When we started it, it was going to be a birthday party and my wife and I decided to uh, turn it into a zombie walk and um, you know to raise money for the Christmas parade so that's really how it started we started with about 25 of our friends and it's just grown ever since the undead staggered along Broadway Street to Fork and Pint where they enjoyed drinks and appetizers and got strange looks from the other patrons Afterwards, they made their way to 313 Pizza Bar and ended up at the American Legion. Those who chose to take part in the poker run received an envelope containing playing cards at each location. At the end of the night, the person with the best hand won a 50-50 raffle. Each year, the proceeds of the Zombie Walk benefits the Orion Area Parade Group, who organizes Lake Orion's Lighted Christmas Parade. 